Hola, 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 va fit, ok, 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 ya, 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 this is it, this is it, this is another Afropenga, yes, yes, that I just did, so we'll be going over this one, so what we're gonna do here, we're going to check over the Afro beat and see the type of approach that I used and his style, yeah, now this is a track that I did, and the track uh, I'm actually selling a, a remix quick package because I remember the package that I did was four tracks for 800 rands yeah so I was pushing the package go, go Facebook and stuff I don't remember pushing it up on YouTube so this is one of the tracks and any the greatest dictate I don't think I did a review and any track on the package is test of times yeah i think it's also the, then the last one was the other remix you one that remix yeah but also guys if if you see this project is is is, is complete it's done but if you want the particular project itself for your own editing and stuff i'm actually selling the projects um for a price most of them i've pushed for e3k three thousand if you're in south africa that's three thousand rand but anywhere else maybe would be around how much is three thousand i don't know maybe it's two hundred dollars or something or more yeah something along those but the project will be available for low price but okay so let's check out the project first of all it's more or less similar to the first one he, he mindset anyway is not the actual thing because of default so we start with a drum so i sh chose like a kick which is very light like that's a, a, a very type of light kick that i used and then going with progression i just went for something which is direct direct okay why not carry on my problem Kind of confused. Now I got cut. Oh, okay. <laughs> Flip it automation because I see I've. So once I do that, it's over. I got a crane. Like that's a simple type of progression, I think. Simple as that. So working on a minor this time. So again, woke. What is kind of important to any track is how I approach the drops, which were very, very, very dope. Puff. That's what I think. Because Zona, they were almost like pushed by a vocal. So you play vocal. Mm. Yeah. So the vocal up uh, as you can listen to it, it keeps on like building up, building up and until the part is a drop out like you know up for example. So that's why I actually actually drop because Lomda New Year Basel like ah it is ah it is ah yeah well keeps going going and then bam on the last part. So that's what I actually used to inspire again with the, the project itself because I build it up. Okay, let me switch this off before I get into some kind of trouble. So I build it up towards the part. Le. As you can see, the part le, is like a build up. <laughs> okay, let's skip forward a bit. Hold up. Funny I clip. 
Okay, that's what that's what I was building up to. Using Gengo E E cut off and as as effects here on the bottom. So let's check out the other types of sounds that I managed to use. That's basically a rhythm track as a whole. That's what I was going to use as my rhythm. So I'll just layer that type of pattern to go out. This is just another layer, another layer. Almost the same thing. Then shake her zam game. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then what the hell? And then it bass. I can hear the bass is also the same type of rhythm. So let bass see, you know. It's actually a cool bass, this one. You can hear in a, in a delay nyan and some reverb. Trans bass 6 on Nexus. So that's the type of rhythm which I kind of followed throughout. Then again, it sounds as um, remember, we started with this bass pad. And then I added Gemma Lewe. Mm, I, I think this is my favorite sound electric because of like a pitch bend and yana paya. Like yo, I, I, I love Lewe. Mm. Okay, club part. Let's play it together with that bass pad. Damn, that was dope. Come on, what's going on pad? Okay, that's that's the pad that I used. Like, I think that's it for it sounds game. You know. Jesus, Jesus. Okay, my sister, I'm going with as effects maybe. And then we have the way you know, the, the pattern. Jesus, oh, I think, yeah, nuts. Yeah, I love the pattern also. So I chopped you on again oh, like this part late like this part little G F sharp So I just kept you on at this point yeah Okay, guys, let's move on to that dope melody. Yo, I get it. The melody is eh, shy. Eh, this track. 
Erfolgreich check out die Melodie. Also. As you can hear, there's a lot of delay in the reverb with flex. Flex. Simple classic. Yeah, that's the melody that I introduced right at the drop. Most of the time, you melody, um, I usually automate them, especially when I work with it deeper tracks, because I want to like, feel to grow on new game or learn a melody to come through. But at this point, I just more, more did right at the drop. At the drop. Including game on a lay. Yes, drums, nyan. Okay, 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 last thing, last thing before we move on game to the part is upper clef vocal you can hear there. If if you can check up there's the vocal chopped up and then the part it says hey hey number three. So I added like a lot of delay cool last vocal chop. Yeah when I The last vocal shop just want us to listen to Lewy. Yeah. You can hear it delays a lot on that part, but on the other parts of the vocal. There's not that much delay. So I just wanted le, 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 the last part to like take me through you know, to let drop. Nah. So that's the idea that I used. So we move on to the let, let drop, which is specific. First of all, I already talked about the melody, which I introduced at first. But what I did to give let drop like more fire, yeah, well, I clip his pad, I added like the root key. Nah root key see okay let me play bass pad first because i think you remember the part yeah that's my bass pad so again we'll clear part layer i added you know about e like this is my, my root key and this one i added both of this way I remember when I was doing the track, I was like contemplating, but I think I should add one on the first drop, then add the second one on the second drop, yeah, well, so that the second drop will be like, it must like more than the first one, but anyways. Hello, <laughs> Now right on after the first eight bars can go off that drop and then we have the keys which are layered to a melody. Yeah, well. Yeah, well, it, it more off the way. Yeah, well, the way. Corner the way. That was it like this. <laughs> Just as. So right. Right at this part whereby I introduce as keys. I add the right. Lena. 
which is like almost the same rhythm. Yes, now you nigga more of that thing and I like chopped my drums at exactly for the first two bars. So you can hear the effect. Now, 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 you have to take note that we're heading towards a verse less beginning. So, send it because I'm going to drop it towards the second verse. So, my plan for the second verse was that uh, I want it to have like a subtle drop and a bit more chilled vibe. Remember that we were all hyped up, glad drop on the first drop. So, for the second verse, let's chill a bit and build up towards the second drop. Also, you see the, there's a lot happening here on this part of the track and upper uh, there's not much happening because I removed almost of his end. So that's when I brought back the vocal, yeah, well, the first part. I wanted to keep more of a uh, of what I had on the drop. So I kept the melody here. See I kept the melody for the second verse but I removed a keys which I, la I later introduced and also something else I have le lead hidings lead hidings black sound Let's check it out you know this black sound my aim I wanted it for the second verse but I didn't want like to shock every one of you on that second verse. So I slowly brought it up as I was ending that drop. So as you can see, its maximum volume is right when the second verse is starting. So I used it for like a, a transition from that drop to the second verse. Yeah, well. Now, even that second verse, I didn't want it to like keep it very low. I also introduced this thing. Uh, 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 I don't know. It's a third kind of progression. And denial. Damn. Whoa. So I also used it for like a, for the second verse. Slowly comes in. Then I bring back the keys that you can see. The shaker. That's the choir. Good.
it's clipping like um, so this second drop going or what makes it like a bit more hyped up than the first one is because I just added a zine oh not not even a zine just one more because remember how we started let me mute these things this is where we started then for the first drop I added these two here one two Now then, for the second, which is the last drop, I added Lena again. <laughs> yeah, that's almost it. So after that second drop, I just did a bridge so the bridge i was like taking it back slowly to initial point arm which is a bit chilled and then ended off can go with a drum pattern that's why most things are automated slowly so let's listen to this thing once again and then end the video. I didn't want it to become this long part ish. I love this track, man. Ooh.